showing you the new front end of the truck. Yes, I went with an AC conversion. I'm missing the bumper, but I, but I will find it sometime. sometime. But everything I find, yeah, no, I get it from Facebook. So don't make fun of it, but I mean, I get deals, and when I get deals, I might as well get it. Like the hood I just got, I got it on Facebook, and the grill I ordered on Amazon and my emblem. But yeah, I'm gonna show you all the video. Hello, guys. The package has arrived. And I know exactly what this is. I know exactly what it is. And I'm gonna show y'all a little, a little something over there on the truck I just put on last week. Y'all yeah, can see we are doing the AC conversion like I said we would. But I'll show y'all how to install everything. Like I said, I was gonna do the AC conversion and the HD hood is on already. As y'all can see, there's a little bit of dents in the hood but it doesn't matter when i get this color match and that painted i'm gonna tell them to fix my hood get it done all that really matters right now is that we have the ac hood already on and for the what i got it for it's real cheap but i'm gonna show you how to take off the old one and put in the other one and put in the new one in it's really really just easy really really easy the only thing you gotta do is take off four little bolts which are 05. This little one is connected up here, and then these two right here, right here, and here, and on the same side, the other side. Take those things off, and they'll just come off. But you'll need two people hold that side and this off, or not. It's gonna fall that way, or it's gonna you probably could crack your windshield, but yeah, just do that and just slide the new one in. But when you do it, don't close, don't just leave it up there like that because you have to align it so it will be kind of because it could end up being too much over here or too much that side that's how mine was mine was like scratching here so i just unbolted it slid it a little bit to the side and now it's perfectly good now but yeah az hood az grill the only thing i'm missing is the emblem and i ordered it so i should get it here next week but yeah let's install this grill right now well guys i lied about it the mail lady just literally came and dropped off the last piece to the to the um um conversion besides the bumper. But this is the last thing I was needed. And that's why I didn't know if I wanted to throw in the grill because I was missing this. Like I tell y'all, y'all know me. I have to have chrome everything. So I went with the Chrome HD. You see how much bigger it is? That's why I needed to get a new one because it's much bigger. But yeah, I'm gonna throw that on and throw it on here. But yeah. Yeah, guys, you can see that part comes off first, down right there. It has some clips that go in here, but I've already taken them off because I take off my grill a lot off. And right here, you gotta take these these what these four bolts off. Well, there's supposed to be four, but I only got three because I'm missing one. It's a size, uh, it should be an 8. No, 10. 10, 10, 10. I mean, I can see right there somewhere. 10. Yeah, take all these off. And then, right here in the back, they have little clips right here. You see? Kind of squeeze these with a ply or something. And they just pop right off. As y'all can see, the big difference is that this grill is much, much bigger and wider. Gonna make it that get an aggressive look to the front end, but eventually, eventually, I will color match this like that. But we'll leave it like that for now, just for looks. But it seems that we have to put and add the little clips for the back because it didn't come with them on. But we'll just put these on now and then probably put the badge in and throw it up there. And I'll show you the final reveal of the, the AZ conversion. But it won't be the final thing because I am missing the bumper, like I said. But I will find that sooner or later. Like I tell everybody, patience is key. Patience is key. Yeah, so hopefully I'll eventually find it. If not, I mean, fuck it. I like it how it looks. It's going to look good. It's going to look more aggressive. Like I said, I am going to get that color match and that color match up there. And we painted that. But this is going to look way more aggressive, guys. Just wait. And guys, y'all see? Y'all see? I have to put the badge already on and the clips already on. But look, I'm gonna give you one last view of the difference of the hoods, the grills. See? 
That one's just more basic and more tiny. And a little more huge and more wider. I'm gonna show you how it looks right now in a minute. Well guys, here's a fire reveal. reason I got the hood and the grill is because if y'all see this hood this hood right here lifts up and goes down but the regular the stock one is like lower like right here no se nota mucho la, the scoop and you see right here this grill right here is like way bigger and if I were to lift the stock the stock hood not the stock hood the stock grill the stock is like you come here the stock right here and that one big gap so I got it I think it looks good. It's so like it's thick. It makes it look aggressive, like big in the front. But I forgot to tell y'all how to put everything back together. But I'm gonna explain everything. Look, literally the only thing you gotta do same thing as the other one. Just clip it all in. But on this one, the clips go on the bottom, not the top. The bottom. See, like this one right here. The bottom. And these are the, these were the original ones, but the HD one goes in the bottom. The bottom. And after you do that, you just bolt these these four bolts that are out here, the 10, 10 millimeter like I told y'all. And then y'all just put this back on here and put the little clips that go in here. But I don't have them because I lost them. And you can see I added that. But I will eventually. I'm gonna color match it. I'm gonna color match this. I'm gonna do silver here, silver right here also on the little vents. And I'm gonna color match this white and white here. And hopefully I find a HD bumper. But other than that, I'm gonna do that. And I have another thing I did to the truck. I didn't record it because I did it like at the middle of the night, like at one o'clock at night. But I got new door speakers for my whole doors. Like I said, I went with DS18s because that's really all I've ever had, DS18s. And I know they all sound good. And also they match my door. Red and black, red and black. But yeah, here's the Jeep. It's not been seen in a minute, but it's there. But yeah, that's the real reason I got it. But I will eventually get a color match. But this is how it looks. Looks bigger, aggressive, and mean. That's what I like about it. But hopefully, hopefully soon. I don't know when my painter will be down to paint it, but we we'll have to see when he can get, do it and get done to it. But appreciate y'all watching the video and peace.